incident occurred on Monday whilst students were taking their supper. We are told that the dining hall specifically collapsed and um, a number of students numbering close to about 40 were all injured as a result of this collapse. And those are the images we got from the rainstorm that led to the collapse of uh, the building where a number of students were already, were actually occupying. And you can see that it's left many of them distraught and stranded. Let's speak to Ibrahim Abubakar, who is a Ashanti regional correspondent. He's been following this story for us. Ibrahim, uh, good afternoon. Thank you for joining us. To start with, What's the update in terms of numbers? How many students were injured? So, Martin, in all 47 students were injured yesterday. As I speak to you, uh, just a while ago, 20, um, 27 of them have been treated and discharged. One, we are told, um, is um, in a critical condition. So he has been referred to Jamase and the other 19 who have sustained uh, various degrees of injury are currently receiving treatment at the Idra government hospital. And a number of parents um, came to the hospital just to uh, come and see their children, whether they are in a good condition or not. And as I speak to you now, the director general of NADMO has arrived in the school. He is currently engaged in a meeting with the school authorities, engineers of the assembly, have also come in the morning to assess the situation just to make sure that um, they fix this um, in earnest. But Martin, this is a challenge that has uh, um, been there for a long time. School authorities, students have complained several times about the state of their dining hall. It is um, a makeshift structure and they are, they've been using it for some time now. But they observe that and the roof was weak, and any severe rainstorm could um, break, bring it down. And they have made several of appeals, but um, nothing has been done. Done now that some of them have been injured, um, authorities have quickly come in, and they are working around the clock to see whether they can fix this situation. And for most of them, they are worried. Uh, it's as if we are waiting for as disaster to strike before we take any action. So it's a bit of um, a challenge for them. Some of the students are still traumatized. They are still trying to um, come to terms with realities. Some are just saying they were saved by grace. But now uh, we are hoping that by the close of the day or by the end of the week, something will be done to fix this um, Dining hall. Thank you very much, Ibrahim Abubakar, uh, updating us on that. Um,